Weather forecast, Emma Lockhart in for Alison Gargaro tonight. Very active night. We saw little showers, uh, thunder and lightning. And now uh, tonight, Emma, just a, a big drop in temperatures, it seems. A big drop in temperatures. Yeah, way below average for this time of year. So today we hit a high of 78 here in Bakersfield. So, you know, like I said, way below normal for this time of year. We should typically be around 85 and we saw a lot of action. This actually shows where lightning struck today over the past six hours. So we did see a lot of lightning. A lot of thunderstorms toward the north of us, especially and this system is moving towards the east. It looks like things will clear out by the early morning hours of tomorrow, but we'll still have those below average temperatures and good air quality that AQI today 50 and those temperatures expected to be similar uh, to what we experienced today. 77 expected here in Bakersfield. Those valley winds 5 to 10 miles per hour over in our mountain communities. We're looking at little cooler temperatures 64 in Fraser Park expected 65 into Hatchby 73 up in Lake Isabella and breezy conditions 10 to 20 mile per hour winds 20% chance of rain into the early morning hours as that system moves out and taking a look at those desert cities. We're looking at those 70s across the desert 76 expected in Mojave 78 in California City breezy out there tomorrow 10 to 25 mile per hour winds. So what we can expect for the next seven days while well, below average temperatures continue. We're looking at those upper 70s until Sunday then warming on up to those low 80 sunny skies across the board. Those clouds are going to clear over the next few days and in the Kern River Valley high of 78 tomorrow cooling down to the 50s overnight. Similar temperatures warming up just by a few degrees and staying in those 70s until Tuesday then warming on up to those 80s. Those clouds clearing sunny skies across the board for your weekend and into Hatchby a high of 65 cooling down to the 40s overnight tomorrow. Similar temperatures but staying in those 60s and then warming on up to those 70s with the sun out and shining and taking a look at Fraser Park, a high of 64, cooling down to the 40s overnight. The 60s sticking around until Monday, then warming on up to those low 70s. But yeah, it's going to be absolutely beautiful mm -hmm. once these clouds clear and we have these below average temperatures and sunny skies. You know, I went home this evening and once it really cooled down, I noticed that the AC was just way too low. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That puppy up There's so always that quick. moment. You walk into <laughs> restaurants or coffee like, shops, it's like Whoa. we forget. Yeah. yeah. It's getting colder. It's right? now fall. Quickly. It's yeah. now fall. Mm -hmm. Save that, that money. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. And uh, speaking of uh, 